Right folks, because it's very cloudy, misty, we, I can only just make out Minehead in the far, far distance. Um, I can't really see Dunkery Beacon today, not really, unless it's in the hills there in the clouds. It might surface a bit later on, but I was right way over there staying. <sighs> I've done. I've explored all that coast, by the way. I've explored all that coast near Watchet to Minehead and all that. I went on a bit of a spontaneous hike once I'd come down Wee Valley and recognised where I was if I wanted to do the Coleridge walk around to West Condock's Head or back the other way to Bicknoller. But th this is a lovely view. Straight ahead of me, I'm right on track now. The other side of that coombe, or I can go round it, I might not go up it actually. There's Beacon Hill. That is the beacon on the top of it. I came down that the other week. I don't necessarily have to go up it, I don't think, but the only thing is by going up it, I know where Smith's Coombe is exactly. Um, but I think I can walk round it. I'm not quite sure what to do yet. But it is the time to turn, to turn back now, which is what I'm doing. It is time. So I've had a beautiful walk up through what's called Wee Valley, W-E-A, on the 18th of October 2018. Um, a short afternoon walk compared to my long day walks, but still quite a, quite a hike. Um, so that's the beacon. I've walked down a valley, all the way down through a valley, down to the bottom there. And I did a little bit of instinctive stuff. Rather than adventuring like the track was going, taking me all over there, all over there, I said, no, no, Sheila, make your way up. It's almost like an instinct, otherwise I'd be over by West Quantock Head. Uh, and that is a different ball game over there, you know? What I've got to be careful of here is I don't deviate down that way as well. Um, I need to keep... <sighs> it's very difficult to know exactly. There's so many different tracks. Um, I th something tells me to keep up this way a bit. Sort of go that way rather, because I think if I go that way, once again it's going to cur make me go that way. So I'm sort of doing a roundabout walk. I haven't come across the place where you have the picnics and the plaques and the road and that. It could be that that's down there. That I don't know. What I'm doing, which just doesn't always work by the way, even though I can see a hill, I can end up going totally off track. Um, which happened to me uh, um, over uh, Porlock Way one, one day. I ended up going down Coombs, up, do, up, down Coombs, up Coombs and round Coombs. And I just thought it meant just going like that, and it didn't. This could happen now. I don't know. There's, they never signpost these places. This place is not signposted, by the way. You can, this, this looks like a tree cemetery from a distance. This, this is where I am now. I could go totally off track. It could be that I should have stayed there. I could even end up back in the valley. This is part of the fun, you know. This could curl around in a minute and start taking me that way. See? It's all dodgy. It's all dodgy. At the moment, though, it seems to be going straight down. Means nothing. There's a wood there. Is that a barrier? Will I get out? Where's the, where's the picnic area? You know, where is it? Where's that road that they said came up here? I, reckon that's, I think it's over that way. It could be that I should have stayed over there. 
But I, I still feel that the it's over here. Something just tells me it's over here. I don't know what's telling me that. Um, rather than stray down that way. It's telling, stay, stay this side, Sheila, where the wee valley is. So that's what I'm doing. I'm heading out to the open there. It could be that the other side of those trees is a road. I just have that feeling there's a road there. Right, over and out for a minute. Right, my instinct is absolutely right, you know. By bearing this way, I've done it absolutely right. Now, obviously, when I came out of the Wee Valley, there were tracks I could have followed. I deliberately ignored them because I wanted to find the baseline which is what I've done. And any, and I can see cars now, I can see the car park. All is safe and well. So what I'm doing now, is I'm gonna join a track in a minute, which I walk down with beautiful views over that side. That's why I skirted away from over there. That's West Quantock Head area. I can do that another time if I haven't already done it. There's a little beetle there, look making his way on his journey of life take getting food and storing up for the winter I expect yeah you get across there before someone treads on you I can see cars now quite a few so some people just drive up here then do the walks you see like I'm parked at Holford and doing a walk. So I am glad that my instinct was right. Uh, my own mental compass guided me to this side. It said, no, don't go down, don't go further that way. And it's worked. There are a lot of cars here. Maybe there is a hunt here. There's a lot of cars and bikers. Yeah, this is the point I was at before. I was on that track there. Oh. Up there, right over and out. <sighs> 